And what I wanted it, this to look like is a wood floor. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna take um, like this spatula right here and just make lines, like they're wood planks. Okay, and then we need some to go the other way. And they go in between those. See how we're getting the wood flooring? Okay, and then take another, uh, the spatula again, and just do lines a little bit lighter. So these aren't, I'm not pushing in quite as much, not quite as deep. And this is a tip number, let's see, it's a tip number three, and I just want to make little holes where the nail holes would be. So I'm just pressing down and using this as an embosser. Okay, looks like I missed some lines right there. Okay, oops, we missed some here. It's funny, I always do that, you know, when you look back and you go, oh, I missed this little thing. Okay, perfect, it's ready to paint. So I've got just some brown food coloring right here and a brush. And I just dip my brush in the water slightly and then just brush it over the top. Now, if you don't want it quite this dark, what you can do is just take some yellow, which this is yellow right here. It's a lemon yellow. Take some of that and brush that in and it'll lighten it up. Make sure you get the color in those little uh, nail holes so it, it actually sticks in there because it's nice if it you see the darker uh, section in there. You know, like right here it's too light in there. I didn't get the food color down in there so make sure you do that. On the edges it's easier to brush from the, the edge like I'm doing in. And then just make sure that your brush marks go the same direction as the wood. You know, I don't want to brush it the opposite direction. And I can pick it up if you don't like the white showing around the edges. You could just take, pick it up. It's a little easier if you're more eye level and just go around the edge. go back over where I messed that part up around the edge. Okay, and there's our base. That's all ready. 